on that show, this is one particular girl named Alyssa. I want to jump through the TV and choke her. She is being so mean to the guy. He's trying to be so nice to her. my bells welcome and welcome back y'all welcome back to the channel you are new here welcome also if you're new and you have not yet subscribed go ahead and hit the subscribe button so that you can become part of the family y'all i am about to get i'm in the line at taco bell i'm about to try this new doritos flaming hot cool ranch doritos y'all probably say you will never know what you're going to try i don't hey welcome what can i get please yes do you have the Cool Red Flaming Hot Doritos Locos Taco. Yes, we do. Give me one second, please. Okay. I have to give her one second, y'all. But like I was saying, my hair is dry because I only put water on it. Um, I didn't put any product on it. So it looks a little dry. Y'all probably say, girl, that looks super duper dry. It does. But we're going to fix it a little bit. We're going to bring the, the not so dry part up here. And I had it in a bun because I just went and got... Uh, I just went and got waxed, so it was in a bun when I laid down on the lady's table, so. But that's neither here nor there. Y'all probably say, lady, we didn't even come for that. Y'all didn't. Y'all didn't. I've tried the chips. The Cool Ranch Flaming Hot Chips are really tasty. They were really good. But I don't know about the taco. Hopefully it tastes like the chips. I think I'm getting hard nerves, y'all. Okay, what else? I want the combo. The combo supreme with no tomato? Yes. Y'all know about Taco Bell. You cannot, you guys, I'm going to have to do the video in my car because Taco Bell tacos, if I, I'm, for, I'm not close to home anyway, but if it was close to home, I still would need to do the video from a car because Taco Bell, y'all know they tacos don't uh, stay crunchy for very long. They might already be soggy. I ain't even, I'm just getting out the drive through. So we're going to see. Also, today I am trying the Doritos Locos Cool Ranch, whatever taco they got at Taco Bell. I got an email. The other day when I went um, to try the, when I, I was going to try this taco because London told me that they had it. But that wasn't true. That day they didn't have it. I think it came out yesterday or either the day before yesterday. Today is Friday, but I think I think it came out on Wednesday. I think today is Friday. Yeah, today is Friday, y'all. I think it came out on Wednesday, but on Wednesday I had already eaten. London was like, Mom, can we go try it? I'm like, no, I've already ate. I'm not hungry. So I'm trying it today, y'all. So here we go. We got the Doritos Cool Ranch Locos Taco, and they made it nice and messy. Y'all see that? Y'all see how messy it is? But we're going to try it. We are going to try it. It's stuff everywhere. Y'all, and I want to talk to y'all about this show I've been watching. I know a lot of people probably watch Married at First Sight. I watch Married at First Sight. I've watched every episode since episode one. Season. Since season one. So now they are on season. I don't even know what season it is. I put it across the screen when I figure it out. Whatever season they are on. I'm not liking this one in particular girl. Y'all, let's try this taco first. Y'all probably say, shut up and try the taco. I'm about to try. I like the chips. I had the chips and I like them. So I'm, I'm assuming I'm going to like this taco too. Mm. It's good. I should actually put um, nacho cheese on it. That would have been bomb with nacho cheese. It's really, really good. And I am hungry, but it's good. So, on that show, this is one particular girl named Alyssa. 
I want to jump through the TV and choke her. She is being so mean to the guy. He's trying to be so nice to her. He planned all these activities he wanted to do. He really wants to be married. She, from the start, said that somebody told her, her psychic or whoever, or I don't know who told her, but she was going, her husband was going to be a man with a tattoo of a lion or a tiger. First, she said a tiger or a lion. And then when she saw the Asian guy's tattoo, she changed it to whatever his tattoo was. And they've just been capturing her so many lies. The, um, the other couples have been capturing her lies. It was like, well, she told me that the tattoo was supposed to be a picture of a such and such guy. And the guy was going to be tall and handsome. She didn't like that guy from the start. So she's trying to blame all of this stuff. Like his friends or um, his friends told me something and I, it just didn't sit well with me. His friends didn't tell you nothing that bad about him. All they told you is that he has a big heart and he likes to help. It may, he may come off condescending, but he likes to help people. That's his way of showing you he wants to help you. People may think the same thing of me because I like to help people too, you guys. I, I like to be of help. I like to be needed. And I said I want to be a, a I, I need some needy people because I don't. Don't come in here thinking I need needy people because I don't. But sometimes you like to be needed. It feels good when people need you. And I'm not saying they need you like financially wise. It's just like if you have a man or a woman and they need you to hug them. And I like to do that type of stuff. So it's y'all that girl I'm telling y'all if I could knock her head just take it and just I want to jump through the TV me and my friend Patrick y'all seen him he's come we had the sushi the one time we watch it and we talk about the show and I'm just like I want to go in there y'all mean cuss but I wish I can get a hold of Alyssa because I would cuss her out it's like that man is not, and then she keeps on saying, but I'm a nice person. Ain't nothing about you that you have done has been nice to me. I ain't seen nothing nice that you have done. What, where are you being nice at? You are acting like a straight up, y'all fill in the blank. I'm like this girl. Y'all, I really wanna, if I get through the TV and fight her, I would. I don't like that other one, Mirla, either. She treated Gil like, and Gil was fine. He was just young, so I couldn't, I wouldn't be able to. I ain't a cougar, y'all. I ain't into them little young boy. I need a man, man, a grown one. But Mirla was evil, too. But then on the show, after a while, when she first met him, she didn't like him. And then all of a sudden, I think I love my husband. And then when they come to the reunion, I don't like him, the way that he talks to me. The, I'm like, come on now. Come to find out she liked the Asian guy. Uh, I forget what his name was, but she liked him. But I be going to fight some of them people, y'all. Because you just don't treat people like that. The girl Alyssa's talking about she wants to live in the apartment. He can live in there for the first half. She live in there for the second half because she wants the experiment, the experience that she gets to hang out with the girls and food. This is a marriage. When y'all move, y'all supposed to move in there together. Not I move in this week and then you move in the next two weeks. No. He was like, either you in or you out. Y'all, he trying so hard to work with her. He was like, even if you just 5% in, I'm 100%. He's 100% in, even if she's only 5%. But she keep on making up all these excuses of, well, why don't you just leave now? You want the experience because you want to be on TV first. And then she said, I hope that they don't portray me to be this mean person on TV. You are mean. You're about a bully. You're a little bitty tiny bully. She is a bully. That's exactly what she is, a bully. And then saying she don't like the way he's talking to her. I ain't heard him raise his voice at her not one time. So what do you mean how he's talking to you? He's not talking to you anyway. He's trying to be the sweetest and the nicest person to you. And you are being... Um, Y'all, my, my blood is boiling on the inside. Because I really wish... Sometimes I wish that I could meet these people. But her mother told him 
that he's the perfect guy for her because she cried. They that all her all her all his friends all her friends told him that she cries a lot and she been crying this whole show. I'm like, if she don't shut up, give her a pacifier or something because she about to piss me off. Y'all, y'all can tell I'm upset, huh? I, yeah, y'all. She made me upset. I just don't like the way she's treating him because he's being so nice to her. And it's like, I just don't get it. If you don't like him, you already... And that's what the people ask him. Well, obviously, you weren't attracted to him physically. She was like, his body is just not... I hate him. I don't want to talk to him. His body is not what I expected. I don't want to go swimming with him. I don't... Then go home. You ain't got to stay here. You want the free honeymoon. She didn't feel comfortable sleeping in the room with him. And I believe most of these, when they do these shows, most of, I know when they get them in the apartment, it's a two bedroom. So just in case, if one don't want to sleep, you know, if they don't want to sleep together, they can sleep in a different bedroom. But she don't want to sleep in the apartment, the hotel, the nothing with him at all, period. It's like, if y'all don't send Alyssa home today, please send her home today, please. I couldn't have been a producer on that show because she'd have been gone a long time ago. Should have been gone the night of her wedding. Sure would have. Y'all, these are really good. Go get y'all some. Just sitting in the parking lot. Cause you ain't gonna make it home. Y'all, but yeah. Ugh. Married at first sight. That little bitty, that, that girl Alyssa is getting on my nerves. And the one guy, oh. Uh, his name is... I don't know how to pronounce his name, but they call him O. He's a nice guy, but he's very controlling. I don't know if that marriage is going to work because he's very controlling. And she's like, you need to calm down a little bit. Calm down. Don't keep pushing me to do stuff that I'm not comfortable with doing. I don't know. I'm, she was fine with, you know, trying it. But the way that he talked to her in the gym and, and not, he wasn't being disrespectful, but just, yeah, you're going to do it. You want your body to look good. Calm down. I told him, calm down. Bring that down a couple of notches. Bring a couple of notches. You're not going to talk to me like that. But uh, Alyssa, I, I want them to put Alyssa off the show ASAP. They need to send her home today. She's like, if I am the nicest person, and like that one lady say, I forget what her name is, but like she say, Nice people don't tell you how nice they are. You trying to convince us that you're nice. You're not that nice. You are mean. You are a bully. That's exactly what you But you guys, if I was to rate these tacos one out of five. <clears throat> they would definitely get a five. They're really good. Get a Supreme. Cause the sour cream do something to it. I'm saying this is pretty much. I've had it the regular way. I haven't. And y'all happy Valentine's Day. I won't see y'all on Valentine's Day. Um, But happy Valentine's Day. I will not see you guys. That day. I probably won't see you the day after that either. Which I'm supposed to put a video. Which should come out on Tuesday. But it's probably not going to come out on Tuesday. I'll be on a little vacation. So it probably won't come out on. I probably won't have a video on Tuesday. I probably won't have a video for a couple of days, you guys. Let me just put that Like out I there. said, go try that taco. I give it a five. If y'all see Alyssa on the street, if any of y'all live in, um, I think they live in Baltimore. I don't think they live in Baltimore. Wherever they live. Boston. If y'all see Alyssa walking down the street, slap her for me and tell her Shelly said to do it. And if she needs to talk to me, direct her where I am. Tell her I meet her in the parking lot. In the dark alley. Y'all, I'm just kidding. But I, I do want to fight her, though. Because she's being mean. Y'all, but I'm about to go. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share this video with every and anybody that you know. And don't forget to hit that little bell so that you will be notified of each and every time that I, yes, me, post a video. Love you guys. Bye. Mwah. Oh. Don't forget to wash your hands. And we're in